What's going on, guys? It's Zark here, and welcome back to another episode of, well, just me playing games. But no, welcome to this episode of Across the Obelisk. I was recently gifted this game as well as Risk of Rain. Uh, the same person didn't didn't uh, the same person didn't uh, gift me these games, but I decided to play Risk of Rain and uh, Across the Obelisk. By now, you guys have probably already seen my game of Risk of Rain 2. Sorry about that. Had to take a drink. Now. I have played this game a little bit. Just to, you know, get familiar with some of this stuff. All four of my current characters are currently rank 7. Starting item blue. No idea what that means. Oh wow, one more one more uh rank and I get to unlock that. Cool. It all started on the princess's sixteenth birthday. When suddenly a burst of energy erupted from the princess's chamber and swept through the kingdom of Sinentia. Royal guards explored every corner of the castle, but found no sign of her or Lord Hansha, the court magician. The king sent soldiers all over the kingdom, but none of them returned. The trail of the princess was lost, deep in the old forest. Near the ancient obelisk that had been dormant for centuries. Desperate, the king proclaimed a royal decree, announcing a reward for whoever brought the princess home safely. The news spread quickly throughout the kingdom. Many groups of adventurers prepared to investigate the obelisk. This is the story of one of those groups. Just wanted to run the, uh, just wanted to run that by you guys while we're doing this. I have beaten this area once so far. And I have upgraded my town a little bit, as you guys can see. I even unlocked a pet shop. All I really can do is bunny though. Cause I need to unlock the other pets if I remember correctly. Mm. So let's see here. And then as far as some of these go, we can't upgrade Captain's Howl, unfortunately. I'll upgrade that though. I 
Upgrade that. Hmm. Upgrade two of these. Exit. Hmm. Really wish I could get the vision ring for him, but let's actually go on our quest, shall we? We're gonna take the bottom the bottom trail the whole way this time. Hmm. Activate deflect. I never use adrenaline. I don't like that. I don't like the the uh, suffer thing. I don't like the fatigue. If I do use it, I use it at the end so that he has so that he has some extra energy light, uh, left. Like this. And then I just end the turn. Then it becomes that boar's turn. Armored. Dead. Touch charge. Okay. Thought he was going to also... Uh, Uses quills. Charge battery. Fire blast. Fire blast. Transmission. I always use transmission on, on the cleric because when I come to the cleric, he not only draws an additional card, but he also gets stronger. Or he also has additional energy. Deflect, slice, uh, expert tracker on Ethelin. Actually, that looks like a pretty good setup there. Aim shot and done. We'll enrage, barricade, even though we probably won't need it. Slash, slash, and then in turn. I hate those barrage attacks. Charge battery. And we win this one. Always take a punch. Rapid fire. Curse of exhaustion. And sure, we'll take that Shadowman. Why not? Fishing contest. Let's see if we can actually win this one. One, one, one. Nope. Hmm. Let's have them heal. I mean, sure, they're pretty much healed already, but no one know who knows how bad this fight's going to be. So we're going to attack. Rupture, Expert Track Evelyn, get rid of one Frostbolt because we're not going to be able to use them all, Captain's Howl, obviously, Enrage, Slice, Defend, 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 I, just, I really don't like the fact that you can still bleed through, through your uh, defenses. <laughs> There's a reason that you're putting up a shield it's so that you don't end up doing doing such a thing. Cold spark. Yeah, I know I'm uh, she's getting damaged, but still. He'll die next turn. Won't have to worry too much about that. Shadow men. Flash this sheep. Holy smite that sheep. 
foresight this bull. Or this boar. <laughs> Woolly shell figures. Deflect. Deflect. Rapid fire. Then for Magnus, we will barricade. We will punch. Intercept on Evelyn. Fast strike and defend. Grizzly fur. Tantrum. We'll charge battery twice and fire blast twice into an elemental ward on Reginald. Reginald, this is for all heroes, so it's not a global thing. You all get regen regeneration one. Deal that. Foresight on this guy, and then for barrier, we shall put a barrier on ourselves and a barrier on Evelyn because why not? Rapid fire! Nice, got all three of them. Ran out of energy, so we shall adrenaline. I know I could have used the ta the attack, but next turn I would have I would have had less uh. Less energy to deal with, which I wouldn't have been able to do much with. That's why I don't like it. Intercept for uh, Andrin. Rend. Fast strike. End turn. Mana gem. Charge battery. Fire blast. Curse of exhaustion. Elemental ward on the on the on uh, on Magnus. I almost called him Wolfgar. <laughs> Good lord, I'm terrible at this. Holy smite! Deflect into aim shot and finish off with another aim shot. Look at this. Beautiful. It's beautiful. Okay, so the first thing I think we're going to do... Uh, do I want to take Repair Armor or Intimidate? Marks them with intimi uh, Intimidate marks them and sights them as well as makes them vulnerable for one turn. Sure, this is, it's a zero cost, why not? Hit and run. <clears throat> That's not gonna help because I because I had to because I had to have a uh, bleed. I don't get bleed that often. Ember storm. Benediction. Ooh. I don't have enough for a basic divination. I see you will travel through distant lands and face powerful enemies. By the way, I can see how uh, how you will meet my brother Vel Velkaroth. Greet him for me. Interesting. And of course, hmm. I know I want stone skin for him. Let's go with another Intimidate, a Mana Shield, and why not go with a Sacred Bolt? Magnus knows, knows Otis, so. I think the first thing I'm going to do is give him the Chalice. Then, as far as he goes, hmm. Might give him the Acolyte's Tunic for now. And as far as him, hmm. 
And then for her, she does deal some shadow damage. So there. And I've never taken this bottom path here before. These two play these 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 two spots are completely unknown to me. Increase the quality and quantity of card rewards at the end of combat. Each hero will be Let's do this. Ooh, wait a second. Mm. I don't know how strong these enemies will be. I'm not going to do it this time. Deflect. Expert tracker for Wolfgar. We'll get rid of Rend. And we'll do rapid fire. And then slice. Then we will adrenaline. And you know what? We'll hit and run. Sure, he'll only have two, but he also does increase his initiative a little bit. Captain Towel. Intimidate. Intercept for Evelyn, because she's the weakest out of us. At least as far as, like, uh, defense-wise goes. Defend. Fast strike. Fast strike. End turn. He's got one extra left, which is nice. Cold spark. Manage him to retrieve, to retrieve that. Fire blast. Fire blast. Frost bolt. And then an elemental ward on, on Reginald. I hate dealing with these dryads so much. Mm, they're an extreme pain in my in my in my rear. Okay, so for our foresight, we shall use it on this dryad. Benediction will heal will heal Reginald. I'm gonna use a flash on the on that one there. We'll do an aim shot on this one. We'll barricade for everybody, which will give them all the reinforcement stat, which means pier slash piercer and blunt resistance is increased by thirty percent, which means because this guy deals that kind of damage. We'll have him punch the Dryad, defend, and then fast strike. Because with defending, the thorns didn't affect him as much. Untangling roots. Trying to heal up their allies. Man, they keep going after my cleric. Charge battery. Ma uh, mana shield. Oh, that's a he oh wow, that's the boosted one. I'll give it to Reginald. Fire blast him. Transmission Reginald, and that'll be all. Ooh, a shadow mend. I can't use that right now anyway. But what I will do is sacred bolt this guy. That sanctifies him, meaning that anybody that hits him heals. Holy smite him, which will heal my guy as well, but also cause cause the sanctify to hit to hit to proc. And then we will barrier Evelyn. We'll intimidate this guy. Fast strike him. Intercept for Andrin, and then defend twice. For this one, we'll stone skin. And then we'll go in for a... Slice. And then we'll go in for another slice against that dryad. Tranquility. Oh, jeez, Starfall, I hate this attack. 
It always drains my shields. Ah, another one? I hate these attack. I hate that attack so much. Charge battery first. Ember storm. Frostbolt. Then elemental ward on herself. Uh, Divine Grace on Evelyn. Um, she's got two left, so I'll only be able to flash Barrier and Foresight. Oh no, I can Healing Rain. There we go. Barrier himself. Foresight on her. Another... St oh. oh, I hate that so much. Enrage. Punch. Intercept for Reginald. Defend. Then Rend. This one probably also has the Starfall too. Nope, it's trying to heal itself all the way. Charge battery, Ember Storm, Fire Blast, and then Curse of Exhaustion to make you slower. Benediction, give me eight. Shoot and slice. Barricade. Fast strike. Fast strike. We win. That would have taken so much longer, I'm telling you guys. Hmm. For her, we'll go, we'll go for the upgraded uh, Ember Storm. For him, we'll take Faint. For him, we'll take Steel Skin. Because that'll... Uh, that'll give him a shield as well as a block and reinforcement. And for him... I think we'll take Mind Blast. Force Glade. You're not sure why, but you want that. But you want that stone. And I don't think I can do. So I can do a higher. So we're gonna do combat. Oh, interesting. So she's a boss. Deflect. Faint. And we'll get rid of rupture. Because these guys are immune to rupture. And aim shot her from behind. Then slice. And slice. Captain's Howl. Intimidate her. Enrage. Steel skin. Defend, defend, and fast strike. We'll do charge battery on her. Frostbolt on her. Then elemental ward on herself and end. No one's really damaged, so I don't need to worry about shadow men, but I can start getting more stacks of blessed. So we'll holy smite this guy. We'll foresight him, foresight her. And we'll just end turn because that'll give us two extra energy. No one's really hurt. no one's really injured right now, so I, there's no reason for me to do that. Okay, so he's still defended, so hit and run would be good. And then slice. Ow, moonfire. Mm. 
Mana gem. Firebolt. Firebolt. <coughs> Firebolt and Ember Storm. Okay, now I'm damaged. So I'm going to need to heal. Sacred Bolt, which will sanctify her. And then I can flash to deal damage. Intercept for Reginald. Barricade everyone. Puncher. Defend and done. Okay, next round. Intercept for Reginald, as I said. She is not immune to bleed, so we will rend her. And then just fast strike and then just fast strike to end turn. She called two more little guys. Oh no, Starfall. Ugh, I hate that. I hate that so much. Ember Storm. Cold Spark against her. And we'll also Curse of Exhaustion her. And then we will Frost her. Oh wow, we actually have a lot of stuff here because we keep on charging. Healing Rain, getting rid of our burning. Divine Gracing Magnus. Holy Smiting her. And my laptop is absolutely boiling for some reason. Expert Tracker on Magnus. We'll get rid of Rend. Stone Skin. Slice. Adrenaline, end turn. Now we give him five, five energy next tu this turn. I was going to say next turn, but it was this turn apparently. Rapid fire. Then hit and run. Intimidator again. Barricade. Then fast strike. It's the Dryad's turn. Moonfire. Moonfire, and let me guess. Entangling roots, I thought so. Okay, first thing we're going to do is we're going to Benediction, which is going to be the only thing Reginald can do, but it does build up our stacks. Oh, yeah, Foresight. Yeah, he's going to pound. Deals damage twice. Mmm. Charge battery. Hmm. Andrin. And she'll get the elemental ward. Intercept twice for Reginald. Steel skin myself and defend Jeez. oh come on to ward myself, or Evelyn. Hmm. For this one, I'm gonna have to heal and pretty much that's it. Heal and Foresight. I'm gonna heal Evelyn, Foresight the Dryad, and end my turn. I'm gonna faint. Get rid of Aim Shot. Because we can slice, slice, Slice. Deflect. 
stone skin. Go in for a slice. Then hunter's marker. Hunter's mark does not do what I thought it would. First, we're going to... Well, well, no, we can actually just punch. Hmm. Defend and rend. Because the thorns get blocked. Ember storm on them both. Fire blast her. Frost bolt him. Next is Reginald. Shadow mend her. Hmm. Sacred bolt her. And mind blast her. Making her insane. Wow, actually hit her all three times. Okay, so we're going to intercept for Reginald. We are going to rend and tear. Until it is done. Wow, she actually deals damage to herself for some of these things. Okay, so once again, we're going to Sacred Bolt her. And then we're going to Flash her. And then... Evelyn should be able to finish her off with, charge, with her charged batteries and her Fire Blast. And we beat the Elder Dryad. Achievement unlocked. You guys don't get to see that, though. Okay, for this... Hmm. Sunder armor. Toxic rain's always good. Electric discharge. Mind twist. Wait for the moon to set. Oh, neat. Dryad mask. That should go to her. I don't currently have him, Andrin uh, as a, with a bard build, so. Lockpicks are probably better. Force crown will make him faster. Hmm. Helmet. I know I got rid of the uh, Acolyte's tunic, but... We'll accept the challenge this time. Even if we lose, that should be fine. That'll be this episode, too, once I'm done here. We shall block for... Evelyn. Barricade. Punch him in the face. Fast strike and fast strike, because that deals more damage, because he's he's immune to bleeding, so. 15 HP, 
two damage. And then every round monsters get buffer. Prevents five harmful effects. Oh, that's nice. Deflect and deflect. Rapid fire. Expert tracker. That actually looks pretty good. And then hunters mark her or him, whatever. It's not really gonna not, not really gonna matter. We can't give them any debuffs at the moment, so. Only smite her because she's the strongest at the moment. Sacred Bolter as well, but she can't be debuffed, so I can't get the Sanctify. Ember Storm. Sure, again, I can't actually dam I can't actually give them the debuff, but it does hit them all at least. Faint. Get rid of rupture. Rupture helps no one. And then that's the last one he has. So adrenaline will will uh, give me four for next turn. And we set for him. Enrage. Steel skin. Intimidate her. Fast strike and fast strike. Okay, so let's see here. Foresight's free, so it, hel it helps get rid of the uh, get rid of the buffers. Uh, we're gonna holy smite her, and then we're gonna shadow mend Andrin. Charge battery, cold spark, fire blast, fire blast, frost bolt. See now she's at, now I've been dealing so much damage it doesn't really matter right now. Intimidator, and then just defend. Good lord. Of course it's everyone except for my real except for this guy. There we go. One, two, three. You took three of them. Three of the seven. Benedict. Healing rain. Good lord. Mana gem. Fire Blast, Ember Storm, Frost Bolt, Curse of Exhaustion. Get rid of Toxic Rain. Get rid of one of the aim shots because we're not going to be able to use them both. Shoot him and slice him. We're slowly winning this. Captain's Howl, punching, then we're going to sunder his armor, 
And, and, and then intercept for Reginald because he's our healer. He needs the he needs the armor. <sighs> really? <laughs> Bet you she's been confused whenever that happens, huh? Frostbolt, mana shield, onto Reginald. Elemental ward, Evelyn. Going to Foresight. And we're also going to Divine Grace, Evelyn. We're going to heal Evelyn. And that's pretty much all we're going to do is just heal Evelyn. We're going to win this one. It's just, going to, it's just a war of attrition right now. Gonna hit and run. And then do that as well. Hmm. Steel skin and fast strike. Jeez. Ugh. I hate that. Firebolt. Firebolt. Electric discharge. Frostbolt. <coughs> See, we're gonna win this. I'm probably just gonna have to heal Reginald this whole this this entire time. Not gonna have enough for heal and a and a holy smite. So just gonna have to be a heal and a flash. Intercepts for him, barricade everyone, and fast strike. Deflect, deflect, rapid fire. And it's her turn. Your heal spells are way too powerful, lady. Seriously. Charge battery. Charge battery. Emberstorm. Next is Reginald. We will Benediction Reginald because he gains 21 from that. And it also boosts his ability to heal. Deflect. And then finish it off with Rapid Fire again. There's Starfall again. Intercept for Andrin. Barricade. And then defend. God, there's Starfall again. Seven attacks in one turn. And they each deal 12 damage. That is such BS, I swear. Transmission, Reginald. Elemental Ward herself. Mind Blast. We win. Alright, so for this, I think I'm probably going to end up taking another... Yeah, taking Intimidate. For this... I'll take Blur. For her, I'll take a Scroll of Speed. For him... I'll do Fortune Telling. And now it's finally time for Yulmir's Awakening. Gonna ambush. Remove the Dryad from combat. Punch, intimidate, intimidate, intercept for him, steel skin myself, and we're going to leave two energy for next, for next round. Deflect, rapid fire, and slice. 
Because without her here, they can't really. He's he's not gonna have be able to deal as much damage. Scroll of speed for her. Uh, Frostbolt for him. Elemental ward for her and elemental ward for her again. Okay, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna start this off with a sacred bolt on him to sanctify him. And then we're also going to mind blast him. And then we're going to fortune call, or fortune tell, our buddy Wolfgar here. We'll get rid of a fast strike, why not? Maybe that'll have Wolf's call come up. Faint. We'll get rid of the aim shot. Expert tracker on Reginald. See what we have here. Um, oh, geez. They actually all look good. Slice. And then Adrenaline will give him four, which will give him two more for next turn. We're going to intercept for Reginald. And then for our next one, we're going to enrage. Giving us six. Then we're going to sunder this. Then we're going to sunder this boy's armor. Fast strike, fast strike, and then defend. Nice. Mana gem. Mana shield on Reginald. Electric discharge. And then we're going to curse of exhaustion, making him slower. And I think the very first thing we're going to do with Reg, well, the only thing that we can do with Reginald is Holy Smite with him, increasing his bless, and then we're going to Shadow Mend her. With the shield, it, blo it blocks some of the damage that we just took. All right, we're going to Toxic Rain him. Deflect. He's got six, that's right. Blur. Hunter's Mark. Keep forgetting I should have done the blur afterwards, shouldn't I? Have? I keep forgetting that that's not how it works. Captain's Howl, there we go. Barricade. Then we're going to intimidate him. Fire Blast. Ember Storm. Charge Battery. And that'll be good for there. We're gonna benediction him to bo to boost to beef up his his uh to beef up his bless flower stream moon catalyst blossom oh he's gonna he's gonna purge his his uh regeneration. We gotta try to deal as much damage to him as possible. We're gonna intercept for Andrin this time. We're going to bring up the de bring up defend and then just fast strike him all the way. Deal as much damage to him this turn as possible. Fire blast, fire blast, charge battery, charge battery, ember storm, and then she'll have two energy left and she's getting like f like five next turn. She's gonna be good. And as far as this goes, we're going to foresight him twice. Moon Catalyst, Nature's Call. He's going to summon two more Tainted Saplings. Uh, we're going to Healing Rain. Then we're going to Barrier Andrin. And then Divine Grace, we're also going to heal him as well. We're going to double deflect, toxic rain, faint, we're going to get rid of rupture, we're going to slice the front monster, 
And we're gonna hunter's mark him. Now we're gonna intercept for Andron again because he has because he's one of the weakest. Evelyn's coming up next, so she might have mana barrier. Uh Sunder Armor only works on the front monster, so we'll barricade. And then fast strike. Fire blast him. And charge battery as well. Frostbolt. Then we're gonna transmission Reginald twice. This should give him quite a boost at the moment. We're gonna foresight him twice again. We're going to holy smite him. And then we're going to heal Evelyn twice. Then flash the big guy and we win. And that was this was this run, guys. Uh, we're going to give him find weakness. Give her scorch. Uh, what ray or superconductor? Ooh. And then greater heal. And for him, hmm. We're gonna do shield breaker. Entrepreneur, guys. All right, so as far as this stuff goes, everyone's pretty much outfitted except for Evelyn here. She needs a potion, which we're probably going to do Yggdrasil's Root. We're going to give him Ilmer's Branch. Uh, going to give him the Shield of Thorns. Because that'll give me uh, two thorns whenever, whenever, whenever I play a defense card. Up to twice a turn. Uh, this gives him a four HP. You know what? We'll just take a hundred, a hundred gold for him. And last time I did the blue portal, so we're gonna go through my favorite color, green. Aqua Fall March or Fall Marsh. These guys have leveled up. Gonna give him follow up. Hmm. Maneuver. Elemental pro pro proliferation. Focus heal. Can claim that treasure, and that's going to be it for this for this uh, session, guys. Thank you guys so much for stopping by. If you like this video, please be sure to hit that like button. If you're new to the channel, subscribe. And as always, I will see you in the next video. And remember, you don't lose, you learn. Gamers, game on.